What's going on guys? My name is AJ. And we're going to be playing again Call of War as Gunslinger. Um, so far I'm really loving this game. It is it is quite a lot of fun. Uh, if you guys get the chance to pick it up, go for it. It's $15. Um, it is an arcade title. It's on Xbox Live, uh, PlayStation Network, and it's going to be on Steam. Uh, still $14.99 if you can pick it up. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go ahead with the next mission here and... We'll we'll see what comes. I'm honestly I have no idea. Thank you, darling. It's interesting how the truth can sometimes seem uh, might malleable, depending upon your point of view. Like how those dime novels make you out to be something you're not. Jack, don't be starting trouble. No, he's right. They do tend to exaggerate. Did they exaggerate your part in taking down the Daltons? Well, I was there in the flesh, boy, so I saw what happened firsthand. Dalton Brothers. Those Daltons were lawmen once, before they all went bad, robbing banks and trains clear across the territory. Until Coffeeville, of course. I was one of the citizens who took up arms that day. Fighting on the side of the right? I did my best, sir. We all did. Interesting. They call me Bounty Hunter. Tempted to try that if you didn't see the, the the thing down at the bottom. It said, "Real men shoot chickens before uh, their opponents in a showdown." <laughs> I'm tempted to try that, but I, I have a feeling I will die. So, who knows? Okay, sorry. This is a longer uh, load than I thought it was going to be. A load screen than I thought it would be. Uh, there it goes. I was about to say I might just skip it, but here we go. We're ready. It was early morning. One of my friends was a local gunsmith, and he handed out firearms to anybody who'd take one. You see, the Daltons got it in their heads to rob two banks at the same time. Two banks on the same damn street. Story was Bob Dalton's girl was always writing Ooh. about how he had no ambition. Oh, well, you're nobody next to Jesse James, she'd say. Finally, the bastard took his brothers to Coffeville just to shut her up. Well, the locals recognized the Daltons right off. Before they could get away, half the town took up arms to defend their property. Put some holes in them! Ooh, I that. Let's take care of that real quick before they start talking again. Uh, executioner. Execute nearby enemies. Deal some headshots without even aiming. Ooh, I like that. Pressing and holding Q will eat up your concentration in exchange for uh, marking nearby enemies for execution with perfect headshots. I, I like that. Ooh, and I got a gun! Cha-ching! Golden rifle. I hope it changes right now. Oh, damn. Am I supposed to go in here? I don't know. The brothers pay daily for their stupidity. But everybody knows they had it coming. There's more to it than that. I read all about that day, so I know for a fact that it went down very differently. What? First of all, it was high noon. A posse of U.S. Deputy Marshals were on the rooftop across the street. Get ready, boy. I'm gonna make a move. The lawmen had been tracking the Daltons for months. Now they finally had them dead to rights. Among them was a bounty hunter feared by many a lawbreaker. This man had no intention of letting the Daltons slip away. 
The marshals tried to get the Daltons to surrender. They'll give up the next <clears throat> one. You just gotta wait to suck them. This bounty hunter knew that the brothers were far too proud to ever lay down their guns. Oh, I thought he was gonna go. You went in there alone to confront those criminals. What? Why the hell One would the I do that? The marshal shouted, Where are you going? Are you crazy? Hey, where do you think you're going, dumbass? That rifle's mine. But he paid him no mind. Whoa. I just, I just fell off there. My bad. He saw a way to get around to the back of the bank. Oh, and he figured out how to hit the Daltons from a direction they weren't expecting. Uh, maybe a bug. Fortunately, a water tower was right there. A moment later, he was climbing up a steep ladder, laughing at danger as he did. This kid's crazy. It was brave men like him who risked their lives to tame this wild country. I'm glad I made it. Heroic men like him, who did what other men couldn't or wouldn't to make this country free. Sign up, Shotgun. Jim Bowie and Davy Crockett, who died defending Is the island. Is that Silas Greaves? Son of a bitch! <laughs> what the? <laughs> Stop moving so much, you little bastard. All right. I just shot him in the nuts, but... Ooh, and that's... Right. I normally find at least one... Over there! Oh, shit. I already killed him. I hate that because I get ready to shoot him. Silas Greaves! What the hell? Hit the bar. Blam! Blam! He came away victorious, taking down those thieving dogs. Anyone else in here? It's a lot bigger place than the outside. His name was Silas Greaves, and when the dust finally settled, he was the last man standing. Sorry, kid, but that just wasn't the way it happened. <laughs> oh, jeez. It was early evening, not high noon. Dalton's blew up a safe. And we're all set to hightail it out of there. I was late to the party, and Coffeeville was already up in arms. Those pathetic deputies surrounding the bank were dropping like flies. The leader, the lover, and the loser. Bob Emmett and Grat. I had been tracking those jokers for months, waiting for them to do something reckless. Now let me shoot. And finally, they did. Those stupid bastards decided to rob two banks at the same time in the same town where everybody knew them. But they still had friends in Coffeeville. I don't know where that shoulder ran off to. Oh, there he is. Oh, now. Um, 
Oh, wrong button. Tooth and nail. They were coming at me from all directions. Well, F them. I caught sight of the Daltons running with the money and didn't want to lose them. Oh. The problem was, they knew the town better than Get I did. Boys. And to top Go it off, I found they myself in the middle of this. another shootout. Oh, here. Did the Daltons go up in somebody's house? No, it was the uh, Smiths, I believe. They were cousins of the Daltons. And they were shooting at the Browns, who were shooting at the Daltons. Which wasn't any surprise, because those two families have been feuding forever. Gee, yes. And since the Joneses are related to the Browns, they shot at the Smiths. Pissing off the Heimhoffers, whose daughter recently married a Smith. Well, bullets were flying every which way as all the old feuds in Kansas caught fire all at once. God. There was a hell of a lot of pissed off people in Coffeeville that day. But that's just the way life is sometimes. Shit happens. It's you or me! Ah! Ooh, I found another one. I kind of thought this was where it was supposed to be going. Oh, crap. Probably there's not some sort of time frame. No. I guess I have to go in here and go out this way. All right. The Dalton boys knew I would never give up. Those Daltons weren't the sharpest knives in the drawer. They always stood together. They set a trap to slow me down and allow at least two of them to escape. The third brother stayed behind to plan me, just in case that trap of theirs didn't work. Uh, do I not go up there? <laughs> it was him the youngest, and he decided to stand his ground and face me down. I ain't afraid of you, Silas Greaves. This is where it ends for you. He was determined to protect his brothers, and I understood how he felt. Taking me on all by his lonesome wasn't exactly a recipe for a long life. Missing them left and right. You ain't getting my uh, uh, But Emmett Dalton survived the robbery in Coffeeville. He's the only Dalton who did. They say he was shot 23 times. Well, Dwight, who do you think put all those damn holes in him? Sounds about right. But I have to admit, that boy had grit. Alright guys, well there's another episode of uh, Call of War as Gunslinger. Uh, if you guys liked it, go ahead and click that like button for me. Uh, I would appreciate it. If you didn't like it, feel free to hit the dislike. I won't stop you. Um, but anyways, stay tuned for more. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.